good morning everyone my name is Laura and welcome back to my channel so I just got out of the shower today is an exciting day um, we are going to take Brandon to the Dallas Cowboy Golf Resort it's a gift card for a VIP experience that I got him for Christmas he's been talking about it since Christmas and we are going to bring you guys along give you guys a tour so stay tuned and keep on watching let's go into the room and wake him up Good morning. Are you ready? Are you ready to go play golf? Are you excited? Mm -hmm. How excited? Mm -hmm. Let's go from one to ten. One to ten. A million. A million? Yeah. I'm really excited. I'm excited for you, babe. Thank you, honey. I love you, baby. I love you. Hey guys, welcome to our uh, golf day. We're headed to the Dallas Cowboys Golf Club for a full day of fun. Uh, we'll get you guys some film on uh, the different holes that they have there, the scenery, and then the uh, uh, VIP experience that we're going to be doing. So we just got here. We're gonna go in and take a look. This here is the backside of the parking lot. You can see that there is plenty of parking. Straight ahead is gonna be the entrance for the club. But just so you know, we did take advantage of the VIP experience, which we're going to take you inside, show you what um, that is included. That is for um, appetizer and your entree before your start playtime, and then also after your playtime, which is really cool. Um, so if you definitely come to this resort, I will definitely say take advantage of that. Um, that was actually a really big bonus. Here I am in the lobby. So you can see Dallas Cowboy portraits are all over. Off to the left, you will see a gift shop, which pretty much carries apparel, any golf balls or tees. Straight ahead, you can see that there are some Dallas Cowboy Super Bowl trophies. The Ring of Honor is the restaurant that uh, you do eat in if you do take advantage of the VIP experience. But I will say that the food was delicious. So they have everything on the menu as far as um, any Mexican, American, they even had some Korean options, which was really cool. But we did um, get there about an hour before our tea time. That was actually kind of pushing it because we didn't really get the chance to swing any practice balls. But I will say that if you do have a reservation tea time, make some room for about an hour and a half to be able to enjoy your meal. 
this is a cocktail menu so they do have everything as far as um, the anything you'd like to drink but it's not included in your VIP experience so this right here you can see the Dallas Cowboys star is right there this is the back side of the club but this is where you'll pick up your golf cart and then you can actually have some practice time to just swing and you know get a few hits any with any of your um, practice balls but it's definitely large enough to um, fit plenty enough people so um, taking turns if you need to here we were just waiting uh, for somebody to leave so that way we can go up there and um, hit a few practice swings so we're gonna go ahead and take you to T1 enjoy the scenery and Excuse me? The putter? So this golf course has apartment complexes that they're just building right here. It's so nice. Let's see if we can zoom in on him. What happened? How do you feel about that shot? Horrible? Yep. Look at these apartment complexes that they're gonna put right here. Oh, yeah. That's cool, huh? Mm -hmm. It'd be nice to have this type of view, like. They're so pretty out here today. Oh. Yeah. That was not a good hit. <laughs> no, you can't go because you have three people over here. All these people that they were gonna hit. Who? All those people. Oh shoot, you just literally threw your ball into the water! What were you thinking? Did it just roll into the water? So one thing about these courses is that they are a little hilly, as you can see. And so what Brandon did is he dropped his ball okay he dropped his ball but good thing is it didn't fall into the water it's because you're rushing your your you're rushing it you're so close I do want to apologize for all the airplanes that you will hear but this golf course is located right next to the airport so just uh, letting you guys know in case um, you come out here you do hear a lot of airplanes <laughs> there we go there we go
No, these are apartment complexes. Or townhomes. I think they're townhomes. balls. You hit three. How many times do you think that people actually hit golf balls I'm sure quite and break all these windows here? To, I mean, look how close it is from the course to their living room window. Like, that's kind of scary. You could be watching TV and then they're just going to like Okay, that was okay. You went past it, but is this still four? Yeah, it's still four. Oh god. Oh my god. How many broken windows do you guys get? I was gonna say you're right by the hole, so you guys are good. <laughs> Bye, have a good day. No, but they're right by the hole. When we retire, I want our house to be right by the golf course. Like our backyard over here. Oh, these, these um, townhomes actually have, um, they actually have a pond. Cowboys Golf Club, Blue Tee, par 72, hole 5, par 4, center 523 yards, front 508, back 537. What does that mean? What does all that mean? I wonder if I should try to hit it from that one or... Front 336, back 367. It tells us where the ball is at. This app is awesome. It'll tell you the distances um, so that way you can strategize where you're going to hit the ball. And the other thing, too, it sounds amazing. So, like, while after we know all the logistics of the course, um, what we can do, we can just you know why you come to play this game. Play some music and the speaker sounds great as well. The other really cool thing about this bush now is that it also magnetizes to your golf cart so it has a magnetic and it just holds on there so it's not rolling around. I get in the golf cart to go meet him by the hole. Overall, this this course is absolutely beautiful. It's so clean. The hills make it look really nice. Brandon says it's one of his favorite his favorite uh, golf courses so far. You know, we've um, gone on vacation many places, have visited other golf courses. It's tradition for us to go golfing anytime that we're on vacation. Puerto Vallarta, Cabo, and so far, the Dallas Cowboy Golf Resort is one of his favorites. We're really loving the view. This golf course overall is really nice. Not to mention the VIP experience that we did that we did get. That one includes two meals along with uh, beverages and snacks on the course from the uh, Heart Girls. 
which we haven't seen one. We're at hole five. We haven't seen one yet to show you guys what that looks like. But once we get around to that time, we'll show you. Overall, this course is really nice. We love it. This hole, hole six, looks like it's the easiest one. I think the only thing that looks like it's hard is this little creek. So guys, don't make fun of me for messing this one up. Don't make fun of him if he messes this one up. But it does look like it's the easiest just because um, there's only a creek here. So really just focusing on hitting the ball over the creek. This is bridge. Oh, jeez, oh, that was not good. I did see where it went. You want me to go grab it? Oh, oh, that one made it in the water. All right, he came prepared. Here, you came prepared because you knew you weren't gonna make it over. Oh, that was a good hit. This is a creek he's gonna have to hit it over. I heard it splash in the water. Oh, you see it? Is it in the water? I dare you to get it. Is it a Titleist? Yep. <gasps> you have to get it then. I'm not Go get it. Dirty. Why would you use your most expensive golf balls right around a creek? So that's what you do. You gotta use a good golf ball so that way you play good. It. It's not. The shoes, the balls, or the clubs. It's the player if you play good. That's what I was always told playing sports. It's not wearing the Michael Jordans that's going to make you the best basketball player. Oh my gosh, somebody's ball is split right here. Let me show you. No, this is a Titleist one. Yeah, you can actually. This is a Titleist golf ball and it's like split in half. I, I bet they get notification that we're, that our cart is locked. I have them on the phone. Turn it off and then turn it on. Yeah, I already did that. Oh, there we go. Okay, so if we put it into reverse, Hang up the phone, we're able to get it out. Note to self, don't go in restricted areas or your, your golf cart shuts off. Yeah, don't do that. It's yeah, don't bad. do that. All golf pools. All the golf pools. So this is a, okay, here's the restroom. So right after, right after hole seven, they do have a restroom and there is a um, 
a little cafe stand where you can order hot dogs such as jalapeno sausages or just a hot dog. If you are a uh, member, you do get everything complimentary. So you get the hot dog, the chips, and a drink. Did you see the Gatorades in the water they had? Uh-huh. That's nice. So, so here. Oh, no. this is my jalapeno sausage hot dog. A little spicy, has a little kick, but it's delicious. Mm. Got some chips and a Gatorade for my drink. If you do do the uh, VIP experience, it's all included. Just no gratuity. You have to add your gratuity to it. And what they'll do is they'll charge one cent and then that's how you can tip um, the worker there. Or any of the car, the car girls, the ones that are driving around the golf carts. They have alcohol, they have snacks, they have drinks. With the VIP experience, it's all, in, it's all included. Looks like Brandon has lost another ball. He looks a little lost over there. Let's see if we can zoom in on him. Looks like he lost his ball in the bushes. You lost something? Huh? Did you lose something? Yeah, ball. <laughs> another one. How many balls have you lost? If we're in hole number eight, how many balls have you lost? At least eight. Eight? Six. So for Christmas, I got him the Titleist balls. And how many do you get in that package? Twelve. You get 12 balls and you lost yeah. eight. That's not good. That means you need more practice. That's why we're here. No. This is the, like, this is where the Dallas Cowboys don't play. This isn't a practice course. It's practice. It's not a practice course. I'm on this. I'm on this I don't know if you're. Right oh, so you did find your ball. Oh, that was the second one. Okay. How's your hot dog? Rate your hot dog. 10. 10 out of 10? Mm -hmm. You got mustard and ketchup. I only got mustard. That was not your ball. You got... We saw you. We saw you drop your ball there. Because you lost one. Another one. Oh, okay, I saw that one for I'll sure. That shit. So, babe, so overall, we're in hole number eight. What do you think of this course so far? I love it. What do you rate it? Uh, a million. A this million? Is the best course, excluding Puerto Vallarta. Puerto Vallarta's first, or this one's first? Puerto Vallarta's first. Vallarta. I do like this one that it's just. They can't beat playing golf in Mexico. Yeah, there's yeah, nothing like. We should add in the clip of um, the alligators that we saw at the course on Puerto Vallarta. Yeah. We'll add it in here. Oh Trying to get it out of this sand dune. Nice. That was a good hit. It, that's what it's about. It's having fun. Exactly right. Hey, I fucking smacked that one. That was smacking. Yeah, you did hit I that, made that one pretty ball good. Fucking, I'm gonna feel that one. What? I made the ball's mama feel that one. You made the ball's mama feel that one. That's what happens when you get drunk and you go play golf. Forget your clubs. 
your pitching glove? Uh huh? Pitching what? Yeah, he comes to get drunk, plays golf, and forgets his uh, pitching club. Had to come back and get it. Got it. Let me see what it looks like. Oh, so that way I know. I think that's the second time you've lost that one. Yeah. Note to self, don't drink. How is it that... Baby, you can put an air tag on my golf clubs. How is it that they serve alcohol on a golf course and you're driving? But they're like encouraging alcohol. Mm -hmm. Isn't that crazy? It's all part of the sport. Yeah. But I feel like you work it off because... Um, yeah, I'm not like drunk to where I can't like fucking do one. No, yeah. I think you work... like, But even like golf is a sport that you walk around so much that by the time you're done you kind of like become sober this is 11. you know what i love about this course i think is that it's just so simple Mm -hmm. like, so pretty too. It's pretty, but it's like... So this is actually right next door to Grapevine Golf Course, which is supposed to be another top-rated golf course in Texas. So maybe next time we can do that. Oh, yeah. Oh, so it looks like there's another um, cabana. They're called Sideline Cabanas. And that's where you can use the restroom, um, get some snacks or some alcohol beverages. We're coming up to it now. Huh? The old Jake Wiggler Diggler? <laughs> Don't say that. Where my motherfucking ball went in motherfucking creek? Did it go in the creek? That yeah, motherfucker. It went in the creek. That motherfucking ball right there, that motherfucking lost, got motherfucking squirrel blood on it. So glad I brought one. So what hole is this? No, I put it. What hole is this? Mm -hmm. This motherfucking ball becomes a motherfucking champion, that. <laughs> Don't want motherfucking scrub, bud. I haven't cleaned my ball since then. <laughs> <laughs> You're cheating. You can't just be dropping my, your balls everywhere. I'm gonna get my motherfucking pitch wedge for this one. How was that hit? Great. Ladies, if y'all don't know what to get your man for Valentine's, birthdays, Christmas, whatever holiday, get him a Christmas gift. I mean a golf trip, not a Christmas gift, a golf trip. Together. But make sure you go with him. Why? That way y'all have valuable time together. And uh all in all, just a good time together. Oh, this is 14. So you're saying that you love your the Gatorade? You love your Christmas gift. I love my Christmas gift and I love the person that gave me my Christmas gift. Aww. Get your couple packs of swings in. I know. You got a big boy driver. Glove. You need a glove? Okay, I go now? Go ahead, baby. You fucking smacked the shot of that goddamn ball. God damn, look at you. Holy shit. Number that's, one. And that's what it's about. And and let, wait, that let, is how you play the game of golf. Let me let, leave that tee in there. Leave that tee in there. Let me hit one. Fuck. 
Now I gotta show you up. See if you can swing a lot better than me. Come on, do a couple stretches. I am a whole bottle of Tito's in. Go. You do not even know where go. it went. Yes. God, look at you. Look at you. Look at you! Baby, you smack that one! Okay, Get in here, let me be your caddy, girl. You make sure you get out the, the caddy, make sure you get out the golf cart like a badass before it fully stops. Ready? Go. Get out. Look at you, badass. Right We're gonna have to cut that. We're gonna have to cut that part. Terry is up the security guard game in the ads too, so that you know the money's getting higher. Here's the missed kick. It's like Greg Olson on the second tee box, wide open fairway, just snap hook into the woods. I can't tell you how many times Fuck, I've seen that I motherfucker from right there. How many times I've seen from that distance. They are playing better than all those guys. Like McCarthy's fired up. Right now, this start for Dallas has been, of course, less than ideal. I think right now your defense makes a huge stop following the sudden change. Are you seriously going to try to drive that thing up the hill? Wait, wait. Perfect shot. Miscues indeed for Dallas. Anger, perfectly good snap. This is going to be living life Laura's way. Best shot of the day. She's going to smack it. That was just a practice swing. Go ahead, baby. That's good. Get that muscle memory going. Look at that. Look at you go. Oh, that was a baby, good, good fucking that was hit. A good, hit. good hit, baby. Look at you. Where am I trying to hit it, I guess? Straight. Hold on. Let me try. What if I do it at Oh, yeah, perfect shot right here. Smack that motherfucker. Look at you. Look at you. you see that? Look at you. Babe. This is hole 16? Yep. Baby, go ahead and grab... Uh, Grab a four iron and just smack it real hard. Here you go. I'll hold that. Look at you. Smack it. Babe, your accuracy is on point. Just Smack that motherfucker. Look at you. Look at you. Let me put you on the PGA Tour. No, it didn't go to no sand dune. No. Come here. I'm gonna drive you. Huh? I'm gonna drive you. Baby, 
Look at look at you. Perfect shot setup. Perfect shot setup. So normally you would use a pitching wedge right here because of the incline. Why didn't you get? But look, I'm gonna tell you what to do. Aim for the ground below the ball. Like scoop it. Yeah, exactly. Scoop it. You're fucking good job, babe. Scoop it. Look at you. Oh my, babe, you're on the fucking oh green. Gosh, it's gonna go down. It's gonna roll down. No, no, you're on the green. <gasps> oh my god. Go get me the putter. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, ma'am. Guys, she just, she is a good golf player. She's just natural, athletic at anything that she does. Are you serious? That close? That close. That's how you play the game of golf. Are you kidding me? What's your objective here today besides? Cutter? I'll switch Mrs. You. Florian? So cool to be playing golf at the Dallas Cowboy Golf Resort on the team day. Dallas Cowboy Game. Nice. We just did an interception right now. Yeah, right, uh huh. Oh, Sometimes young players just make young Watch mistakes. You see Malik Hooker right here. He steps up, and I think he loses up with his eyesight. Dallas needed a big turnover and a big play, and they get it from Malik Hooker. Sweet. Is that interception? Yep. Hey, wouldn't it be cool to, if we won? Well, after here. We're gonna go um, eat. eat at the um, at the bar and grill, right? Here at the golf course. And then we can just watch the game from there. Yep. Take ah. it in. This is the best Christmas present ever. Now, not just because of the golfing, but because of the quality time that you can have with your significant other. Preach! So nice. I'm just saying. I love golfing. Golfing is fun. It gets very. You can get very competitive if you keep score the right way. Oh, nice hit. We got here at 12.40 and it's 4.12. So this golf course has 18 holes. So how long did it take us to finish up these holes? Uh, what time is it? 4.12. We've only been at it about maybe three hours. 18 three hours. holes. It's a good course. It's, it's flown by. It's been so much fun. You you really cannot, it's, it's hard to beat the quality of time that you have. Yeah, this is a nice course. So for it this for this being the last hole, 18, where's your ball? This one has a lot of sand dunes. This will be your challenging, the most challenging hole. Do you agree? No. Oh wow, you hit it so close.
All right, you guys, so we just got back from the Dallas Cowboy Golf Club Resort. Resort? Is it a resort? Golf Club. Dallas Cowboy Golf Club. Uh -huh. Dallas Cowboy Golf Club. What'd you think about it? That was great. It was the second nicest golf course I ever played at. Second nicest golf course. It was very, very good. The food was really good. Oh my god, I think that was my favorite, was the food. Kind of surprising that they had Korean food there. And it was, uh, oh, so good. Yeah, they had a lot of um, kimchi. Uh, well, yeah, that was, a, and then uh, Korean pork, right? I did see mm -hmm. on the menu. Yep. So I thought it was really good. So thank you guys again for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video. Bye.